What summons thee, Donald Bane? Something persists against all odds. Who was the one to dethrone my father? Surely you are enlightened. The almighty Macbeth had done away with Duncan. Macbeth was a man that fell to his demise shortly thereafter his victory. Perhaps his absolution had come after his lifetime. But surely he was not the one to hold the dagger. What irks you, son of Duncan? Time has yet to heal thy gashes? Oh, the gashes have healed, and hardened with vengeance. Vengeance? What dost thou know about my father's murder? Speak! Who is doth thee but think hast slain thy father? <laughs> <laughs> Enough of your foolishness! My curiosity shall be satisfied, or else thou shalt taste the end of my blade. He hastes to anger. Peace, son of Duncan. The blood has already been spilt amongst you. I advise thee, spill no more. Blood? Spilled amongst us? Pray pardon me what you mean. Speak, you fiends! Here is then you wear, son of Duncan, brother of Malcolm. For the truth shall unshackle thy heart, but like a feather it will burn in the soul. I fear nothing but the ignorance of the matter. Thou hast been won. Macbeth was mad, yet this one matter. For even his mistress did suffer and die. His ambitions did bring the king's head on a platter. Anything less would not satisfy. The treacherous devil himself that he is. The enemy of your blood is closer than you'd expect. For, for, for man, for great power, would dare to, to transgress. transgress. A great sorrow was cast over my soul. I can still see a shadow that did control the instruments of my father's doom. Who doth there spill the blood of my kin and country? <laughs> Perhaps it was Macbeth's porter who did slay my father. The drunkard was as mad as any man could be. Besides, he was there at the scene of the crime. Thee knoweth nothing, child. Thine enemy hath sold his soul to Satan himself, and his madness is not to be compared to that of a mere drunk servant. It was Macduff. His family died. Who could be madder and who suffered a worse fate than his lady? And ambitious is he taken on Macbeth? A great conjecture, yet further from the truth you could not be. Lennox. I did hear a rumor that he accompanied Macbeth in an excursion to you witches. He is without the ambition that plagues the morals of the one who spilt your father's blood. Besides, the royal blood does not run in his veins. Royal blood? Save your vain death for a later time. Thy ignorance is amusing to us. We speak the truth. Thy enemy shares the very blood that floweth within you. The dareth blaspheme the crown in its heirs. <laughs> <laughs> it, it cannot be the, the only one that shares my blood within this terrible tale of tragedy. Tragedy is... 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 Aye, brother, tis I. Malcolm, what is this treachery? Thy curiosity shall spell your death. You dare to take your father's breath and soul? You deserve to know everything. These hags are mine. They serve their master, Malcolm. I gave them orders to allure dear Macbeth. If he were not so gullible, I would not have been of much success. Our father stood in the way. I wanted power. For father! Say hello to Father.
I just lost my breath. That's why I was talking like that. <laughs> <laughs> like, all right. I thought you were gonna try I'm trying to be all emotional.